Welcome back to the Super Small High School Years Rags to Riches. I have hair just hanging over my face for some reason. The good news is tomorrow I'm getting a haircut. The bad news is I've already recorded a bunch of videos, so you'll see the effect eventually. <laughs> anyway, that was completely irrelevant. Welcome back. Here we are. We've got the baby, little baby Addison looking good. You know, I was thinking about it. I was like, it would be really nice if we could go for a little stroll over to the, you know, the fairground, take little Addison with us. But, you know, you, baby, babies can't go anywhere. They're just kind of there. It'd be nice if they, like, it's already an object. Couldn't they just put it, like, in a pram that just, like, moves, like... I feel like you wouldn't have to do anything for that. Anyway, uh, Kev, you need to get back to knitting because I really want to get that that little onesie. Hunt for egg. Ah, oh, Easter. Yeah. No, we got to knit clothing. You're going to keep knitting. Are there toddler sweaters? No. All right, well, let's make another children's sweater so we can have a few of those. All right, Reg, uh, do you have work or something? Uh, 24 hours. All right. Now, what about magic? How are we, how are we going with our magic skills lately? It would be nice to get all the spells, but, you know, that's neither here nor there. We could work on... Oh, that's right. I got three fame points that I haven't spent. Yeah, I reset it, but I kind of left it because I didn't really need it. Uh, networking, easier socialization with famous sims, okay. We could do upload videos from the video station. But that's a whole other thing we have to do. I kind of wanted to get up here to the easy street. My boss doubles my paycheck, you know, I think that's kind of where more where I want to go. So I think we should try to get to be a global superstar just by doing writing and stuff and getting royalties. So let's do, let's keep writing, right? Ah, oh, love email. Wait, can I not write it to Kevin? Oh, there he is. <laughs> He's all the way down the bottom. Now, I was also thinking I might move Addison downstairs while we're doing stuff down here, because uh, maybe not next to the fire. Uh, not really, not really room, but I'll put you there. There you go. Move objects. Oh, okay. Really? You're crying already? I only just moved you. All right, Kev, change dirty diaper, bottle feed. There you go. Now, actually, when do you have work? Well, right now? Oh, I guess it's a holiday, though, is it? Yeah, okay, we got to do it. It's a holiday. We don't have to go. I mean, I guess I could go if I want to get promoted. But nah, we got we got to knit. I mean, we need to get that. We need to be able to make onesies. <laughs> like, that's all I want. How'd you love Margo? Was it good? <laughs> all right, let's write. What's the highest level? I don't remember which level stuff comes out at. Let's do a mystery. We were doing big wallet stories, and I believe one of the suggestions a while ago was The Vanishing Gardener. One of the stories, you know, from the very first big wallet let's play, Get to Work, episode one, there was a handsome gardener. We were going to marry them, and he disappeared. Never to come back. So, you know, that's what we're going to write about. <laughs> it's going to be a bestseller. Uh, $1,100 from royalty is not bad. We do need to also work on, you know, his dream was to, you know, go into fashion, which we haven't really got to yet. We were doing trendy in the beginning. We haven't done it lately. We bought the retail store to sell outfits. But again, that's kind of more of a side thing. Maybe we should go there, hire some employees, and then we can just like run it in the background. Like we can just open it, but we don't have any employees to be able to open it at the moment. So maybe we should set that up today. Oh, look at this. Kevin knitting, Reginald writing, Addison. Oh, it was awake. Addison was sleeping, but Addison's awake now. Probably need to eat. So bottle feed talking, make a cuddle, make it make a cuddle, make a silly face is actually what I meant to say. Oh, uh, why can you not? <laughs> why did you turn into very flirty while you <laughs> while you're interacting with the baby? Please, please don't. Also, I, I actually don't know. Oh, you know, it's probably this. Oh, wait, that's not even enabled. It's not that. I was like, why? I feel like Reginald and um, and Kevin are always really flirt, like way more flirty than normal. What are your traits again? Gym right, high maintenance, active. There's no reason you should be super flirty. Just because he's enamored with Kevin, uh, not Kevin, with um, Reginald being nearby. Is that why? Just in gen just so that's why. Okay. So is that like a sentiment thing? It's from like deeply in love. <laughs> yeah, look at, his, look at his biography. Acolyte and rising star. Let's go. And economic degree, graduated with honors. Pretty good. He's very smart. All right, have we finished another book? Ah, oh, Flower Bunny just became good friends with Kevin. I'm not even sure how that happened, to be honest. They're not even in the same space, but uh, sure. All right, let's go ahead and... Oh, Literary Digest. Yes, that will get us more money. The Vanishing Gardener. Let's go. Oh, you know the other thing we need to do? Oh my gosh. Okay, hang on. Clear, clear some, uh, some notifications. There we go. We need to get a cat because Sydney and Ava have a cat and we can't let them win. Well, so I feel like we could use a cat, you know? How do we adopt again? I always forget. Household, adopt, adopt cat. There we go. All right, knitting project complete. Well done. Oh, animal clothing. Yes, please. Oh, wait, I can't make cat clothing? What? Really? Yeah. I can make clothes for foxes, rabbits, 
llamas and cows and chickens, but I can't make a cat and dog outfit? Huh. Okay, that seems strange. Uh, let's just do some beanies. Are there any normal beanies that don't have animal stuff on them? I guess not. All right, adopting cat. Let's go. Oh, Duchess. Yeah. I like the little smudge face on Buddy though. I like, oh, Duchess is such a cool name too. Let's go Buddy. Buddy's kind of smush. All right, let's get some stuff for the cat. <laughs> we can't, we can't let Sydney win, okay? All right, let's get the auto feeder. We love an auto feeder in my games. Um, I guess... Uh, hmm. Probably go here. I think that'll still work, so that should be all right. Should we do a different color than blue? I feel like we always have blue. Well, we want a fish, so hmm. the colors aren't that great. Let's go pink. Sure. All right, we need a litter box. We'll get, should we get the laser self-cleaning? I don't want to have to clean this. Um, hmm. I don't really have room, and I don't really want it in the kitchen. <laughs> ah, maybe the front porch. That seems lovely. What a nice welcoming thing for people coming to visit. <laughs> I've got nowhere else to put it, okay? And um, we'll get a little scratching post, which can go probably where Addison is right now. Sorry, Addison, you got, you've been bumped. Put you there. It's actually, I feel like that's more central anyway. A little scratching post. Yeah, that's nice. What else do we need? I mean, like an actual like cat tree would be good, but I don't really have room in the house at the moment, so maybe not yet. Let's just start with this and see how we go. Hey, welcome. We're very well. S oh, you're just letting yourself in. Okay. Oh, and then you dumped the cat out there. <gasps> yes. Go say hi. I always forget you can select up to three and then choose when they arrive, but we only selected one and Buddy's it. Aw, hey Buddy. Hey little Buddy. You like, you like me? Oh, you know, you don't hate me. That's pretty good. That's a pretty good sign with a cat. <gasps> Scare, why, why would I do that? Offer friendship. <laughs> oh, <laughs> was he just like, eesh, yuck. <laughs> you wanna be my friend? Did it work? Kind of. Are you yelling at the cat? Oh my gosh, we have to adopt this cat to save it from this lady. <laughs> Why is she yelling at it? Leave the poor thing alone. I'll save it. I'll save it. Adopt. Look, now we're like, I love my cheerful introduction. Just makes us like best friends. It's Holy kind God of, God. kind of, <laughs> kind of amazing. All right. The cat is mine. Let's go. Did I adopt it yet? Adopt. Yeah. Let's go. Yes. Yay. Buddy big wallet. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Buddy big wallet. Congratulations. You've added it. We, can we tell? Let's tell Sydney. Whoa. Yay. Oh, the frame rate's gone again. Awesome. All right, let's fill the food. Uh, frame rate is still bad. I, I did save. You know, I did all the tricks. Every time I do all the tricks, I usually edit it out of the video. And then people are like, obviously you have to, you have to click save. You have to delete this. You have to, I don't know. The, 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 it'd be nice if they could just fix it. So the game stopped doing this, but you know, okay. There you go, kitty. Hey, um, please don't go on my counters. Can I be friendly? I don't want to be mean. Um, hey. Um. <laughs> I see an option to be like, hey, do you not mind not going on my counter? I kind of mind you climbing on like the couch and stuff, but maybe not where I prepare food. It's okay, buddy. Oh, I'm over here now. Oh, you're down again. Oh, I'm very confident. Let's go. Do you want to say hi to Addison? You want to, you want an onion? You're like, can cats have onions? I know dogs can't. <laughs> buddy looks afraid of something. Yeah, I think it's just the coffee machine. It's okay, buddy. I'll give you a treat. Here you go. Oh, I'm getting project complete. Oh, you have to pee real bad. Okay. Hey, my mud puddle's gone. Yeah. <laughs> I guess all it took was restarting the game. Who's a good kitty? You're a good kitty. Yes, you are. Let's go show. Let's go show uh, Sydney. Oh, <laughs> well, so wait, have we met? I don't think we we met his dog yet, did we? We might have to get a dog as well. They're still not married though. I think maybe actually maybe what I'll do today as well is maybe we'll jump over to Sydney's family and see if the baby actually is Sydney's because we don't know that it is. Hey, what's up, guys? Oh my gosh, <laughs> is that your dog, Gracie? Aww. She's so cute. Hey, Sydney, you want to meet my cat? Wait, that's not my cat. <laughs> that's your cat. You want to meet my cat? Hey, Sydney, check it out. Hey, Sydney. Oh. Hey, Sydney, I got a cat. You want to see it? Also, oh. do you mind if I use your toilet? Because I really have to pee. All right, what we're going to do now, we're going to swap to control Sydney and Ava. And I think we should set up the wedding. We'll do a quick wedding. It's not going to be like an hour long episode wedding like, <laughs> like we did a couple parts ago. But I think we just got to get that. Get that done. So they're at the same stage in life, you know? Hey, I've changed clothes. So I'm Sydney now, by the way. Oh no. <laughs> Sydney's like, oh no. He's got a cat now. We're only one step ahead with dog. We must make more. All right, let's check. First of all, let's go to, go to Ava and check. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, these are all like Sydney's siblings, right? Isn't that who they are? <laughs> oh wait, no, these are you. Oh my gosh. No, these are her. Oh my gosh. How big is this family? I, okay, yeah, I. <laughs> 
The babysitting in this game is kind of, it's really funny when you have aging off because they just keep having babies. Uh, when aging is on, obviously they would all grow up and then it wouldn't be like the family having 500 babies, but you know, it's a little bit funny. Anyway, daughter. Okay, so we know that it's definitely her daughter. The father is Sydney. Okay, there you go. It is confirmed. Sydney is the father. <laughs> it's like going on Maury or something. All right, and then, oh my gosh. <laughs> Maybe we need to go through and age all these kids up. All right, now, now that I'm playing as, hang on, I'm playing as uh, Sydney, I need to try and impress Reginald. I'll, uh, I'll enthuse about upcoming wedding. Yeah, yeah, well my wedding, my wedding's gonna be better than yours. Yeah, I know you went to Solani, but this one, this one's gonna have blackjack and and it's gonna have uh, uh, live music and, and, <laughs> What is Sydney's job anyway? He, I'm a, a salary person, level one. Hmm. Not, I mean, not not as uh, advanced as Reginald. You mean level ten with multiple raises? But you know, you're doing you're doing great, Sydney. And that's really nice. He has a lot of good skills though. Actually, he did skill up. Must have been during like university. Did you actually graduate? I feel like you probably didn't, because that's the problem when you don't actually play The Sims. Like he was there, but he never really graduated or anything. What about Ava? What are you up to? Nothing. Okay. No, no job. That's fine. Uh, your skills are limited. Literally every sim has this fear. I, I don't think I've ever seen a sim that doesn't have this fear, by the way. Okay. Anyway, let's, um, you can go home now, Reginald. <laughs> no, actually you can say whatever. Let's plan, let's plan our wedding. Oh, we should have it in Tartosa because Ava is actually from Tartosa. That'll be nice. Cause then she'll be going back to her family, to back to her hometown, you know, well, our home city. All right, wedding ceremony. Yeah, bride and groom. Oh, I guess we didn't get any any of this stuff. I guess I don't, no, I'm not gonna bother because we already, we just did a whole wedding. I'm not gonna go through and do all that again. But we will, Reginald will come, of course. Um, <laughs> your name is Baby Markovic. Yeah, the Markovic family is gonna come because obviously that's Ava's family. The Price family is gonna come. And then Kevin from high school and, and Kevin from Reginald's uh, family. Family? <laughs> Husband. All right, so those are my guests. Lovely. All right, we'll, we'll keep it simple, but he is competing. So I've chosen first and spousal kiss and exchange vows. Now, obviously I could choose everything, but I don't want to get out of control. I kind of chose ones that were more focused on everyone looking at Ava and Sydney, because you know, he's trying to prove something. <laughs> and then, okay, we need, to, we, need to, we need to do something about this. A nice like sort of party outfit, but I feel like maybe we should do something different for the actual wedding. What was in my wedding stories? Let's have a look at those. <laughs> you know, I kind of like, so I like the white suit because it looks awesome, but I also like the flowers on it because it's kind of like, that's what Kevin and Reginald had. You know, they had those sort of beachy uh, floral Hawaiian shirt theme, but obviously we're going to Tartosa, which I guess is kind of like a European city. So maybe, well, it's kind of pretty Mediterranean looking, so it might still be warm. Anyway, so the white is good. Keep you a little bit cooler. And we still have the flowerish theme. <laughs> it's a competition. Yeah, well, my wedding, my wedding is gonna be a Tartosa. Mm. <laughs> Very handsome. There we go. Hey, that didn't change. Is it because I created a second outfit, even though I selected the second outfit, it didn't count? Right, well, anyway, let's edit Avis. <laughs> Cause I'm sorry, this is not, I, is this even formal? This is not even formal. This is like smart casual at best. Anyway, let's go formal. Let's go. What's my wedding story stuff? Let's check that out. This Let's Play is the most I've ever used Creative Sim. All right, we've got a lot of options here. I think that's pretty, that's pretty stunning. That's nice, but it doesn't really look like a wedding dress. It's kind of more like you'd wear it to a wedding, but not as the bride. Oh, I guess I should say it's not really a bridal dress. I mean, that's a very nice dress. Also, probably not a wedding dress. Ooh, the flowers. Yes, please. Do we have, oh my gosh, matching. That's kind of cute. Right, we're gonna change those shoes though. <laughs> Cottage living, hang on. Oh, wait, these are the only formal shoes we got in my wedding stories? What? Probably good for the beach though, so let's do that. <laughs> All right, hair. So she's got pretty short hair, so we don't want to go long. I guess we'll go, go short. What's the short options? Okay, short is actually too short. Make like medium. <gasps> flowers. That's, that's kind of cute. Oh. I always think, I'm like, oh, let me change the color of the flowers, but I always forget it's based on your hair color. It's so weird. Okay, I quite like that. Should we do a little, do they have wedding stories makeup? Is that a thing? Oh, it is. Gold or whatever this is. Oh, that's a different thing. Sure, I just, I just doing what the, the game has. That's all I do. <laughs> Wait, we need her signature gloves. She always wears gloves. <laughs> 
Because, like, for some reason, her every day has gloves on and then she wears rings over the gloves. It's quite bizarre, but, you know, that's her thing. That's oh, Wait, hang on. She has a nose piercing when she took it out for the, the wedding. I mean, I guess you could take it out for the wedding, but wouldn't you just keep it in? I feel like that's kind of a thing, so maybe we should put it back in as well. All right, it's eco lifestyle. No, no, no. I don't care if it's formal or not. That's her thing. Is it really? So, why is it so squished, by the way? Is the nose piercing based on the size of a Sim's nose? Because that's kind of strange. Oh, she has completely different piercings in different outfits. Right, okay. I mean, I guess. Why? Okay, it's a bit strange. I'm gonna just put it. I mean, you'd probably take it off while swimming, would you? I don't know. I don't know how piercings work. I know you can take it off, but well, maybe not in the cold, wouldn't it? Would it freeze? How does that work? People with piercings, let me know in the comments down below what the what the what the go is. I don't know. Do you sleep with it? I'm all, okay, I'm gonna change it to have the same one here because I feel like it'd probably be the same. That's kind of fun. It's kind of cute, isn't it? <laughs> okay, there we go. That's nice. Okay, annoyingly, Sydney's outfit. I'm gonna have to put as number one because it just doesn't want to do it. Which is stupid. It's like, oh, cool, you designed a whole outfit. Oh, you did it as number two. Ooh, sorry, we don't know how to use number two. I'm just gonna delete his other one so he can use that one. All right, dress code, polished, color. Let's try, because, you know, we're going for the white themed wedding. Although now that these are compared, that's definitely more cream, but whatever. Uh, cool, <laughs> next. Uh, so we want to go to, <laughs> should we just have the wedding at <laughs> Reginald's house? Yeah, we're all coming around. It'll be fine. No, no, no. We want to... Oh my god! The Markovic residence. That's kind of cute. I didn't realize that was Ava's house. Like, her family home. That's actually cute. Let's go there. Oh, it's right now? Oh, I... Why do I always get confused? When it says plan event, I... that to me means, like, plan, not initiate event. I... They really got to change that wording. I do it every time, and I know I do it every time. But anyway, whatever. Here we are. You know, it's probably... <laughs> it's still in our beach uh, wedding attire. That's funny. Oh dear. Marcel Price. All right, we gotta wait for everyone to arrive. Hang on, I'm not supposed to see the bride before the wedding. So this is where Ava grew up. It is a beautiful home. It is actually really cool. I love this place. Tartosa is a really nice world. It's just a shame that the actual uh, gameplay in the pack was uh, rough. <laughs> but yeah, they've got a beautiful little wedding venue back here, which is great. Should we hire a pianist? But we don't have much money, actually. A pianist on the way. Okay, okay. We've got no wedding cake, but that's all right. Let's, um, should we... From is, is everyone... Oh, you're gonna go on the computer. It's okay, it's okay. We'll, we'll try and focus everyone over here, I think. Is there... Hang on, let's go like this. Let's turn on some backyard music. All right, can we can we go here? Ah, Reginald, yeah! Where's, um, is Kevin here yet? Oh, there he is, there's Kev. Wait, who's this? The Entertainer! <laughs> My pianist, we hired a ghost. What, we couldn't find anyone else on short notice, so we just hired someone that's dead? All right. Well, here comes Mimsy. Who the heck is Mimsy? Is Mimsy someone I should know? <laughs> yeah, she's the ghost from the Von, ha Von Haunt estate. Why is she my entertainer? Well, I will give her that. I am definitely entertained by her showing up. Hey, Kev. It's kind of weird seeing my Sims from the perspective of playing other Sims. All right, do we even have enough? We don't have enough seats. Uh... That's all right. Let's just say, um, please take your seats. Come on. And then I'm gonna go here. You're gonna go here. Oh yeah, I also have to make sure that I, uh, weddings, you gotta turn off uh, autonomy. It has to happen. All right, everyone's sort of on their way, which is good. Savannah's here. <laughs> the ghost pianist is here. They're gonna play some nice music for us, hopefully. Oh yeah. Wait, is that like rag time? <laughs> She's playing like rag time music. Uh, <laughs> can I, can I request like the wedding song or, oh my gosh. Ava's like, why did you hire this? Why did you hire this ghost? What are you doing? <laughs> oh my gosh, this is pretty funny. It's like <laughs> this wedding that we're trying to like be better than <laughs> Kevin and Reginald's. We got a ghost piano playing uh, ragtime music. Awesome. Okay, so <laughs> we basically have this music playing at the wedding, you know? Hmm, yeah, let's go. So here we go. We got the beautiful wedding song playing. Alrighty, everybody. You want to <laughs> walk down the aisle now? Here we go. Uh, walk down, send down the aisle to Sims. Uh, we're going to go Ava and Sydney. All right. Hang on. I got to, I got to mute the in-game <laughs> so we can hear our beautiful ragtime. Here we go. Oh, that didn't stop it. All right, fine. We'll just listen to the in-game one. <laughs> okay, now we... We got the wedding music and the ragtime. Beautiful. <laughs> oh no! 
The babies are hungry. Oh my gosh. The three babies that are in this household are gonna die while we're here. Oh, it's beautiful. Such a beautiful wedding. <laughs> This is such a tragic wedding. All right, exchange vows. It's exchange vows. Oh, my heart is broken apparently, okay. Uh, everyone's crying. The ghost has gotten up. <laughs> I love you no matter what. Even if my ex-boyfriend decides that he wants me back, I'll still love you, even though we will be separated. <laughs> Aww. So who weddinged it better? That's the question. Kevin and Reginald or Sydney and Ava? Aww, yay! That's nice. I like that, um, I'm still, we're still, wait, where's Kevin? Kevin? Uh-oh, maybe Kevin's angry. He's probably off angry somewhere, is he? Oh, there he is. Okay, he's, yep, he's angry. He's definitely angry. Are you punching Bluffy? Now, where are all those babies, by the way? Oh my gosh. Oh, did Kevin take care of them? That's good. Oh wait, no, that one's still bad. <laughs> Okay, may not be the best wedding. All right, now, um, can, we, can we take care of the babies, please? Because we can't have this ruining my wedding. All right, guys, we're just going to pop upstairs, take care of the babies for a minute. Uh, bottle food. Make sure the babies aren't starving. Ah, there we go. All right, now, <laughs> everyone's still stuck sitting. Uh, do we have lights out here? Or is this it? Might be a little dark. Let's hire a mixologist. And we're going to turn on uh, <laughs> ragtime. Where's our ragtime? There it is. All right, now we're going to go ahead and ceremony activities. Gather for first dance, <laughs> and then we're gonna go. How do I do this? No, uh, yeah, have first dance with Sydney. There we go. Alrighty, let's get on the dance floor. I don't think it's working because he's busy doing that. <laughs> All right. Oh, this baby needs a diaper change. Okay, I'm taking care of the baby while everyone's waiting on the dance floor. Okay, her first dance. I think it's. You gonna go? Oh, but there we go. Hey, $140 for my holiday. All right, I think the babies at least are not gonna starve, which is good. What's this? Slow dance. Uh, okay, whoops, I did it twice. Great. All right. Um, you can get up, by the way. I don't know if you're glued to the chair or something, but it's okay. All right, here we go. Here we go. All righty, everybody. Come watch us dance together. <laughs> yeah. I mean, everyone seems to be into it. Uh, oh, are we all just going to dance now? What's happening? Wait, why, why are we all just randomly dancing? I didn't select to do that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, whatever. Yeah, let's go. Oh, dancing is in my bones. Yes, it is. Very nice. All right, set up the rag time. Uh, all right, wait, we did our first dance. Why do I have to do it again still? Oh no. I don't have an option to do first dance anymore. <laughs> it's gone. We did it. All right, let's do a spousal kiss. Uh, congratulate on marriage. Well done. All right, uh, uh, romance and then... We would like to do <laughs> Trevor baby spousal kiss. There we go. Oh yes, you're still playing ragtime. Amazing. <laughs> yeah. You know this this particular song, which whenever you hear ragtime, you'll always hear this song. But it just reminds me so much of playing the game Locomotion for hours and hours. <laughs> I do love that. That's our wedding music. Oh look, they're going. Wait, are we doing our first? Wait, what happened to the spousal kiss? <laughs> Wait, you guys literally did the like exact opposite of what I said to do. Hang on, there it is. Spousal kiss. Okay, can we also... I still can't do first dance. It's just not an option. Well, I'll let them complete this slow dance. Maybe it'll work. Wait, what? Oh, right. I was like, why do I have two weddings? But no, one's Easter. That's fine. Okay, no more slow dance because it's not ending. Still doesn't count as first dance, but anyway. Spousal kiss, please. All right. And spooch. Oh, yeah, they're all reacting to it. Oh, Vlad is my bartender as well. Suck on that, Reginald. Oh my gosh, they didn't kiss properly. Suck on that, Reginald and Kevin. We got the same bartender. Let's go. Ceremony activities. Throw rice. You don't really need to, but just do it anyway. It'll be fun. Wee! Wee! Woo! Woo! Wee! Yeah! That's fun. <laughs> Woo! That's actually cool. I haven't seen that before. <laughs> Wait, so we just did the spousal kiss as well. What did, okay, now this wedding is busted. We got a ragtime ghost pianist. We got a vent. Oh my gosh. You, maybe that's why it fails because we keep hitting our faces. Okay, can we, can we try and like successfully kiss? Oh my gosh. Really, guys? What's going on? All right, let's just get this. Let's just woohoo. Nothing else is working. Might as well. Oh, oh we can't. She's like, we can't woohoo in there. Okay, well then don't, use the shower. Uh, yeah, go in here, it's fine. Try for baby, yeah, why not? All right, let's make baby number two, let's go! Yeah, woo! All right, how's, are you going home? Oh, my ghost is gone, that's sad. How are you guys going? <laughs> I reckon this is the best wedding ever. I mean, it was a pretty funny wedding, to be fair. I quite enjoyed it. Now, where is, who's uh, Ava's family? These two. Do we have some tea, maybe? That might be nice. Orange blossom tea. There we go, make some tea. Or not. Oh, poor tea, there we go. All right, now we can say 
Serve tea to... Oh, hang on. Can we just gather for tea or something? Hmm. There's no option for, like, have tea or anything. Oh, let's give Reginald some tea. Here you go, Reginald. It's a bit strange, isn't it? That I'm specifically walking over with a cup of tea to give it to Reginald. Hey, Reginald. Here's your tea. I know you didn't ask for it, but there you are. <laughs> He's like, okay, I didn't really want that, but... Oh. Uh, hey, where's Kevin? Kevin? Did you already leave? I guess people- Oh no, there he is. He's back at Blarfy. <laughs> wait, wait, who's that? Oh, okay, that's one of the- Wait, that's one of Sydney's family members, not Ava's. Why is he in the kid's bed? <laughs> oh my gosh, flirty introduction to Kevin. Now that would be tea, but no. No, 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 we're not doing that. And like, <laughs> we're not doing that tea story, because that would be rough. Um, hey Kevin, would you mind getting out of my, uh, childhood bedroom? I assume this is Ava's, I don't really know, but... Okay, now that I know him... There we go. Now I should be able to take him a tea, right? There we go. Just gotta walk back across and uh, grab the tea. Hey Kev, I got a tea for you. Tea time! Mmm, <gasps> yummy. Oh, I don't know if you like that. Um, alright, let's go here. You're my parents, right? <laughs> I think so. I figured I should go say hi. Uh, oh yeah, go Kev! Look at him dance. Um, is that really the outfit you wanted to choose for this event, Mom? Hey Dad. It's me. I got married. Are you proud of me? It's like, you didn't serve any food at the wedding, though. <laughs> Alright, let's say, uh, while we still have everyone here for the wedding, give toast. There we go. Oh, <laughs> he's like, oh no, not Vlad. No one wa Why do people keep hiring Vlad as the bartender? No one wants to order drinks from him. <laughs> Alright, thank you for coming, everyone. I really appreciate it. Okay, you guys are walking away. Thank you, everyone. Uh, I just prefer not to face you all. Alright, can everyone blow some bubbles? Yay! Bubble party! <laughs> All right, this wedding's done. <laughs> Good wedding, everyone. It was nice. Thanks for coming. Thanks for coming. I appreciate it. Now we got to get back to our regularly scheduled programming. Now I said that was going to be the whole episode, but how long was that? <laughs> to be fair, that was fun. It's kind of interesting seeing my Sims from another like family. All right, here we are. Back home again. How's our baby going? You know, I feel like while we're here, I might actually age up this baby because it's been a while uh, in game terms, so. Oh, and we should get some pet stuff for the pets while we're here too. All right, Hillary aged up. They're going to be a inquisitive toddler. There you go. Yeah! Sweet. Oh my gosh, what are you watching? Ah! <laughs> Good lord, no. All right, let's, um... Aw, isn't that cute? Let's get a little toddler bed. A little race car, that's pretty cool. All right, then we need pet stuff too. We already have... Oh, wait, they don't have a bath, actually. We need to get a bath for the toddler. Oh, and the dogs, actually. The dog. All right, so I'm going to remove the shower. We're going to put the toilet here. Move the toilet paper. We'll get a shower tub comp. Oh. Oh, yeah, I forgot we don't really have money. All right, well, we'll get that one. We got a thousand bucks. Not too bad. Oh, we got a few things in here we can sell. Is this the, ta is this the table you stole from the thrift store? <laughs> I'm going to sell it. And we've also got the Supreme Freelancer thing, which I'm going to sell, and university homework. And, oh, there you go. Wait, so wait, hang on. You did graduate. You graduated Foxbury Institute Language and Literature with honors. Hang on a second, then maybe he can get a better job. Hang on, let's see. Because you're raising a family, I feel... Yeah, yeah, look. You can start this. So we can be an author. Uh, oh, private attorney. <gasps> if Sydney becomes like a higher powered attorney, that'd be pretty sweet. So yeah, attorney or author, and that's kind of it. Wait, how can we be a... Author in what career? What career is this? Oh, the career is author, short story writer. But then why is there also a writer, writer's assistant? But that I can't <laughs> get a bonus in for some reason. Let's be a private attorney. That'd be sweet. So hiring lead litigator. Let's go. So wait, what am I? Level eight. Dang, dude. Heck yeah. That's a, why, yeah, why didn't you take that job earlier? All right, so he's now a lead litigator, so at least we'll get a little bit more money. All right, now, anyway, we're not here to play as Sydney, but, you know, we're setting stuff up. All right, let's get uh, a little feeding station for the animals. They can probably share a bowl, right? Uh, we need a litter box, which 400 bucks It's pretty expensive. It's going to go on the front porch as well, much like at uh, <laughs> Reginald's house. And we need... Probably a scratching post, at least for the cat. Maybe a platform so he can one up uh, Reginald. Okay, it's pretty cool. Actually, you know what? No, he's gonna get this. That's sweet. Oh, that one's cool. I like that one. That's cool. And then for the dog, we should probably get some toys, right? The toy box. There you go. And then we've got potty. We've got a bear. Maybe a toy box for the, the toddler as well, actually. Can't forget the actual kid in the family. <laughs> I got a toy chest for Hillary. Move that over a bit, I guess. Is that okay? I don't know if this all works. You know what? I'm just gonna get rid of that. It's kind of in the way. All right. That should be pretty good. All right. So they kind of have the stuff they need now. Uh-oh. Should Sydney get a 
Jump start and accept the assignment. Sure. What do you even have to do? Visit university law class. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool job. Anyway, we're not we're not here to play Sydney. <laughs> Save and go to manage world. So now they're married. Potentially another baby on the way that I set up rather than the game because we we did try for baby. We don't know if they're gonna have another baby, but it might just appear one day. I mean, I'm sure Sydney will call up Reginald and let us know. <laughs> oh no, we're <laughs> we're still over at the other house at the wedding. It didn't take us home yet. <laughs> Okay, we, we need to go home. <laughs> We're a little far from home. Uh, good old cold Copperdale. All right, well, you're really gonna go to the toilet, so you go do that. And I assume we probably have work tomorrow, right? You also need to go to the toilet, so you wanna go upstairs. Then you're kind of hungry, so we're gonna get some food. Do we have leftovers? Yep. All right, so you're gonna go to the toilet. That's good. And then you're also hungry too. Easter was awful. Well, we went to a beautiful wedding. So I would say that's pretty epic. Hey, buddy. What's up, buddy? I'm gonna praise you. Oh, why, why am I scared? Fear of the Dark. Oh. Didn't I just get rid of Fear of the Dark? Like yesterday? Well, not yesterday, last episode. Why do I have Fear of the Dark again? Like, what? <laughs> what? Stupid fears. Right, I've only got 4,000 points. I want to get brave so I'm not scared anymore. Hey, buddy. Yeah, who's a good cat? You're a good kitty. Yes, you are. Oh, yes, you are. Give you a treat. You know, give you a little hug and all that. Yeah, a little bit of loving. And then I need to get some leftovers as well. Oh, do we not have any leftovers? I think that was it. <laughs> Then Kev had the last thing. All right, clean out spoiler too. All right, Kev, you need a, oh, how she, how's your plopsy sales going? Uh, no offers, no offers, no offers. Awesome. <laughs> All right, let's try with some plopsy. Try, we need to sell one thing on plopsy. Knit a sweater. All right, Kev, not Kev, uh, Reginald, um, you're all good. You got work in five hours. You do need to eat though. So let's maybe just make a bunch of food again. That's the best thing we can make, a roast chicken. Let's just do that, there you go. Let's make a whole roast chicken at 3.30 in the morning. Seems legit. Oh, baby alert, baby alert. Oh, wait, not bottle feed. What am I doing? Finish diaper. <laughs> ah, kitty. I don't think Kevin's even met. Oh wait, no, yes we have. That's good. We do have a relationship with the kitty, so that's fine. Yeah, laser pointer. Yeah, I think I also need to feed uh, Addison, so I'll do that. Oh yeah, look at him go over here. I'm glad that the uh, hot tub doesn't freeze. I guess maybe they leave it heated all the time and waste all the energy. All right, grab a serving. There we are, and I'll pop that in the fridge. Yeah, we became friends, let's go. All right, then we need to resume knitting. We just gotta get, I guess, maybe level eight. I mean, it's either level eight, level nine, or level 10 <laughs> to make baby onesies. We're gonna find out. They love to run around and might get hyper. Oh, that's cute. Work starts an hour, all good. Oh, look at that. Little buddy sleeping there, Addison sleeping there. Dad just knitting away. Oh, you're awake now. That's kind of cute though, isn't it? Look at that little family scene. Aww. I'm not quite sure that how that's going to turn into a green sweater. That's what we're making. But I guess maybe it did. All right. I unlocked energetic lifestyle. Reginald did. Okay. I'm sure that won't come to backfire or anything. All right. So we finished this one. Uh oh. You scratching? No, no. No scratching, please. You have a scratching post. Who's that? Pet. Yeah. I know you want to scratch. Can I tell you to scratch? How do I like... I literally never play with cats in The Sims 4, so I'm actually not really sure how that works. <laughs> I don't know how to do it. Uh, well, what I'll do is I'll say friendly. I'll do a little brush and I don't know, I'll give you attention. Maybe that helps. All right, Reginald's off to work. Great. Now I have to keep working on knitting because, wait, where did the cat go? Oh, it's under the couch. <laughs> That's cute. Oh, cat's off. Goodbye. Oh, yeah. oh yeah, good kitty. This thing is so creepy. Don't the like lasers shoot out of it and clean it? Like what if the lasers malfunctioned and shot out while the cat was on it? <laughs> Wait, let's see, here it goes. Oh wait, oh wait. Oh, there it goes. Oh my gosh. <laughs> hey kitty, you like the fire? Uh-oh, awkward dilemma. A new coworker has joined. Make him my best friend, let's go. Performance gain medium, that's what I like to see. I feel like I'm like high enough skill in everything these days that it all, always goes well. Also, it looks like we might get another raise. Don't mind if I do. $1,400 from royalties. How much do we get from the new book, by the way? The Vanishing Gardener, $298. Oof. Not as good as Reggie to Riches, unfortunately. <laughs> Knitting project complete. Okay, need to do another one. Uh, let's do another beanie. Let's do the black and white one then. I think I also need to give yeah, Addison a feed too. Oh, oh, Sydney's calling. Tea time. Hey, Kevin, I've been thinking about getting to know Maya Ford better as a friend. Now, I don't want to read into this too much, but I feel like Sydney calling up Kevin to just ask a casual question is more loaded than he lets on. If I were you, I wouldn't do that. We're gonna tell, we're gonna tell Sydney not to make any other friends. <laughs> no more friends. All right, talk and cuddle. Now, Kevin, you need to level up. We need to, we can't, we can't age up Addison until they have a custom onesie. <laughs> oh, toddler and baby onesies, let's go. All right, cancel that. 
Baby onesie. Yeah! Ooh, which one do we want to go with? Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Let's do this one. I like the green and yellow. Don't worry, Addison. I got you. It does take a long time though. Because I'm pretty tired. But don't worry, Addison. The onesie's coming. Hey, kitty. You need attention too? Okay, hang on. All right, I got some duties to actually take care of. And, oh, baby's pooped itself, I think. Okay, I'm coming. I'm coming, baby. Stop talking to the cat. There we go. All right, kitty. Back to kitty. Cat, hug. I'm gonna go prowling. It seems to want to go prowling a lot, so I'll let you go do that. Uh, oh, I wanted to do those things first. I don't know why I did the prowling thing first, but all right, whatever. <laughs> Let's go to the toilet and then we're gonna go to bed. That's my stuff. My, I feel like Kevin just really is like not as successful as Reginald. Like Reginald could sell stuff on Trendy like that. Oh, we've got no offers at all. And they've been up there for like a week, I swear, some of these. 7,192 and we got a raise of another $20 an hour. It's pretty epic. All right, let's go to sleep. Uh, oh, there's a robot. Hey, what's up? Who's that? Ah, oh, Miss Dame Noir Vaults 2.0. Yeah. All right, I think I'm gonna leave this part here. I think that was pretty good. And you know what? I kind of enjoyed playing the Sydney and Ava uh, perspective and like doing a little bit there. You know, I would be open to doing like, maybe even like a whole episode playing their story alongside. Like, I don't want to take away obviously from Reginald and that, because obviously I still want to do a lot with this family and have his kids grow up. But because we're also planning on having Sydney and Ava have their kids go to high school at the same time as Reginald's kids. I think it could be fun if we do an episode here or there where we sort of play them up to that point, kind of like today, and just sort of see how that all unfolds. So let me know if you're interested in that in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time and have an awesome day.